not that bad though. We wanted. There's a spot we wanted. Way back there. Kiss it goodbye till tomorrow, maybe. Yes, this is our lovely home for two days. Urch. All right, so we're in Cypress Hills camping with Andrew and my brother Al. Camping in the park for once. <laughs> Normally we're out in the bush, but we settled for Cypress Hills. Just because we're in Saskatchewan, there's not much else. <laughs> So everybody's got their tent set up except for Al. Me and Andrew were both rocking lightweight stuff. Check this out. Well, you guys seen my tent before. Andrew just got himself the new... What? Well, I'm just talking about your tent. What kind is it? Uh, trail Tech. Trail Tech. A trail Tech by the North Face. Yeah, Trail Arc. Trail Arc. It's better than his last tent. Last, his last tent was like a kid's tent from Walmart, so. <laughs> I kept bugging about it, and then he finally got a better one. And then Al over here, this guy's like the furthest thing from like lightweight camping. <laughs> Holy cow, how many person tent is this? And I, eight. An eight person tent, jeez Louise. And uh, wait till you see his, <laughs> his mattress. <laughs> <laughs> this thing is huge. It's like the size of like a queen size mattress in your house. <laughs> and he just bought all this stuff today, so. Yeah. Good thing we're not in the back country or else he'd be going with a dolly. All right. Let's go look at this mattress of his. Andrew just loving the new tent. Making myself some noodles. Yeah, that's hilarious. Just cooking Hopefully in the little burn the tent down. No doubt. <laughs> Next thing you know, up in flames. Whew. Al's just about got his tent ready. It's taking forever. So this is this behemoth uh, mattress I was talking about. My like, jeez Louise. Queen bed. Yeah, it is a queen size. I wasn't even kidding. Holy cow. Yeah. And the tent's all put up. Oh yeah. Finally. It's like the adult tent and the two kids tent. Oh yeah, the two little kid tents. <laughs> Apparently. Except it took us like an hour to set this thing up. Okay, yeah, pull that. It's worth it. Pull it out. I will. Hi Jinx. Hi right, Jinx. That's my brother's dog. Hey Jinxie Poo. Hey, you being a good girl? Oh god. Yeah? This is old fashioned way. There's my swing door. Holy, it's like a freaking house. Yeah, a swing door and everything. <laughs> Looks nice. Way too big. <laughs> Wait till we go in the back country. Hey, Anna? Huh? I said, wait until we get in the back country. Andrew, what are you doing? Jinx, how do you keep getting off? Yeah, Jinx keeps getting off her freaking harness. She's like Houdini. Okay. Andrew's just making a fire on the ground. Not even supposed to. <laughs> Say hi to everybody. Hey. Hey, little girl. Hey. Oh, you just want to be closer to everybody. Is that it? Yeah. <laughs> Andrew just breaking the rules. Al opted for luxury, but there's no plugins here. So you won't be able to plug in his. <laughs> Can't plug in my bed. <laughs> won't be able to pump it up. Unless he blows it by hand or we drive to an electrical site, pump it up, throw it on the roof of his uh, Escalade, and then drive back. Hey, Raymond, help me pull it out. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Take your shoes off. Check out that little squirrel. This 
guy's eating hot noodles. Andrew's time to shine. Made itchy bad noodles off a little camp stove. There you Twigs. go. There's a little twig fire. Enough to cook and saves fuel. All right, now we're just getting some wood. It's kind of nice, it's free. Let's go check out Al's tent here. <laughs> He's even got oh, a his little jinx. Little jinx. Holy cow, dang, how'd you blow that up? Hmm? How'd you end up blowing that up? They're big oh, old lips? Yeah. Oh. Got her made. Let's got see those done. pecker lips. <laughs> Holy. Look at that. this. Look at this. Luxury dog bowls. Yeah. Couple switch cool. through the light. Yeah, you want to see the light? You want to see the light? Hit the switch. Well, he's got a light switch. What the deuce? Yeah, check it out. Okay, flick the switch. Yeah, that's Lee. I'll stand to holy cow. You gotta hit the fucking full yeah. luxury. Here, video me on your bed. Grab yeah, it here and get the hell off my bed. Whew. We're gonna oh. cook some burgers now. What a deuce. Oh. <laughs> Gets nice, to our tent's going, our fire's going. Yeah, our tent's on fire, yeah. Now we're gonna start cooking some supper here. What are we gonna eat, burgers or hot dogs? Whatever you want. Yeah, we're gonna cook something up. Making some hamburgers, some potatoes. It's funny, we needed tongs, so I made some bushcraft style tongs. Flip the burgers. They work pretty good, I think. Alright, cheers. Oh, yeah, okay, Derek. Some good eating right here. For the first time in like three camping trips, we didn't burn the potatoes. Oh, yeah. So now we're just gonna butter these up and, and eat them. We actually have butter this time. And we're not roughing it. And there's it. butter this time. <laughs> so we're not quite roughing it like last time. So I guess we're going to bed. It's not too bad. We made some new friends. Kevin and Cherie. They're they're just camping in the next lot beside us, so yeah, they're pretty friendly people. <clears throat> recommended us doing some horse or back riding tomorrow so maybe we might do that who knows but anyway it's bedtime it's dark out so I guess we'll see you guys tomorrow peace bye Ray good night Andrew <laughs> good night Al good night. <laughs> <laughs> peace so we just woke up not long ago. What time is it? I like eight, eight thirty. Uh, yeah, it rained a bit last night. Uh, I think we all slept with like a bunch of logs though. It was, uh, <laughs> didn't want to get out of bed. The squirrels were kind of annoying in the morning though. I thought it was gonna be the birds, but nope. First thing in the morning, they're chirping. Couldn't go back to bed. But now we're just making food, bacon and eggs. Oh yeah. 
Andrew made his fire. And cheated. He cheated. There's our awesome neighbors. <laughs> Ta-da! No fire today. Mm. Nothing better than bacon and eggs. In the morning. Yep. Courtesy of Chef Boy RL. Chef Boy RL, you heard it. <laughs> so we took a cruise out to Lookout Point. It's looking pretty cool. Look, you can see fucking a hundred kilometers away the great sand hills. That guy's farm? Yeah. That guy's got a big motor on or fifth wheel. <laughs> Now we're at another little spot called Bald Butte. Is that what it's called? Bald Butte? Yeah. Jeez, it's not a good hill for Crocs. Yeah. We're gonna go do some horseback riding, but apparently the guy's closed for today. And then we went to go check out the zip lining. And it's all booked up because there's a school event going on there. So I guess that goes the plans for today. So I guess we're just back here and uh, at the campsite. We're going to be doing a bit of a target shooting. We got the little BB gun and Andrew's slingshot. So that's pretty much what we're doing now. That and cooking hot dogs. So. Just peaceful. As you can tell, there's a lot of pine sap coming off this tree. And apparently that's a very good fire starter, so what we're gonna do is collect a bit of this stuff and test it out for ourselves. Yeah, she works pretty good if you ask me. Might take a couple of sparks to get her going, but once it's going, it goes pretty good. And if that wind wouldn't have blown it out, it'd be still going. So the verdict, yeah, I think it would be a pretty good fire starter. So I'm gonna go collect some more. So I just beat Andrew in a good old game of war. Al's snoozing, so we're gonna go do a bit of exploration before we start cooking supper, so let's go do that. There goes the deer. Nice, a moose. It's kind of spooky out here. Dun dun dun. It's like you're to use your tripod. <laughs>
Holy, 16.5. Better not go too fast there, Alain. Are you going 16 or 17? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> All about 10. That's gotta be the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. 16.5. Like how the heck do you go 0.5 a kilometer an hour? Okay, now it's recording. <laughs> Pioneer Channel, we're in for a storm. Yeah, yeah, apparently tonight it's supposed to. Well, there's warnings for severe thunderstorms and there's a tornado warning, so who knows? Bat batting down the hatches, I guess. <laughs> Hopefully, it misses us though, because that would suck. But I guess I'll keep you guys updated. If there's a storm that happens, you guys will know about it. Anyway, good night, Andrew. Good night. Good night, Al. Good night. Good night, John boy. <laughs> good night, keep the guy with the hook hand. <laughs> good night, pony boy. <laughs> All right, peace. Hey, good morning, guys. So that's pretty much the end of our trip. That was the end of day two. Yeah, and last night I think we got pretty lucky. I think the storm missed us, but it did get pretty windy in the middle of the night. But I slept like a log. I think everybody else did too. So, so now we're just packing up, just slow going. And then I guess we're heading out of here. Whew. Apparently there's cougars out here, but we never got to see any of those, unfortunately, except the two-legged kind, but. <laughs> yeah. Andrew wanted to try catching one with a, luring it in with a bottle of wine. <laughs> uh, all jokes, but anyway. Thanks for watching, guys, and if you like it, uh, subscribe to my channel, and see you guys in the next episode. Peace.